Welcome to Dan ARG YouTube. Endurance Ugiagbe, they send message to Edo youth. He say, as he be say, Fulani hurt men, never reach city. Fulani hurt men where they kill people for village, as he be say, they never reach city. This is not the time for Edo youth to join vigilante. Go pursue all those Fulani hurt men where they for our village for Edo state. Come out from the village. Make I leave you, make you hear from Endurance Ugaibe. In a moment like this, I enjoin all Edo State youths to join the Joint Security Network because it's good for your own health. It will help you to keep fit. It will help you to protect yourself and protect your land. Edo State is bleeding and we are not supposed to behave as if we don't know what is going on because our communities have not been affected yet. The smaller communities are being captured by the full and health men today. And it is time for us to rise, to say no. We welcome people to our land, to do business, to live and work, to earn money. But we cannot accommodate sets of people who have come to shed blood of our own in our own land. If this kind of thing happens, we are not supposed to look away. We are supposed to stand up to make sure that we all march down to that community and chase those people out. They have tampered with the eligibility of staying in such community. They are not supposed to be in that community anymore. So I also enjoyed the commandants of the Joint Security Network in different communities to have an indoor meeting to know how to form an alliance to always go to communities where there are issues and crises. We shouldn't forget that the northern leaders who are hungry for powers, for power, are using the Funani SMA terrorists for their political agenda and programs. So I cannot deny for this present administration in Edo State not having hands in all this kind of agenda because they want to remain in power, they want to be in control forever. So the best thing they can do is to make sure that they suppress the people to remain in power. So we are going to say no. For you to lead people is not by force. It is the people that will choose you to lead them. Once they are tired of you, you have to leave. But these people know we are tired of them, we are tired of their system, we are tired of their administration, we are tired of their fake promises. They want to suppress us to remain there to continue to lead us. And we say no to it. No to it. This is the time to end this terrorist attack. Because very soon, don't be surprised, these people will take all over and you begin to see shed, bloodshed everywhere. So now that they are taking over a few communities, we have to also stop them there so that they cannot advance further. Now, if you check out those, these little these communities that are very small, we have some few youths who are still farming because that is what they are doing to earn a living. You go to a market today, you see farm produce. Some of these are responsible youths are the reason why we still have enough food to buy and the reason why things are not even really atrocious. People are complaining that farm produce are so atrocious. You are the people have not even seen anything. How many people are farming? This should be the, the first statistics evaluation we're supposed to do. How many people are farming? Now, the few ones that are farming are the ones these Fulani ex men terrorists are killing in the bush, in their farms. Imagine I, as a young man, I'm a farmer. Imagine after going through all I need to go through to farm, somebody will bring cow to come and come destroy my own crops. You expect me to be clapping for the person? When the government has not provided any security for me, when the government has not created a system to make sure that these people don't encroach into people's farm land. So my people, let's call it spade is paid. This is a proper encroachment. Freedom of movement is not stupidity. So let us all stand up because we must say enough is enough and put an end to all this nonsense once and for all. Thank you so much. I encourage all Edo youth to stand up because I believe in you all. We are gallant to handle any issue that comes to us. We are one people. We believe in ourselves as one people. We live. We are living beings. 
and we can face anything that comes our way. Anyone that says that they want to come and give us problems, we give them double and chase them out of our land. Our land belongs to us, it does not belong to anyone. And anyone who feels they can come, or in the name of colony, or whatever, to take over our land, they have failed. They have failed. They have failed. And they'll fail completely because we are not going to fold our hands and watch them do that. So thank you and have a nice day. Now we don't hear from Edurance Ugyagbe. Let us know what you think for comment session. If you never subscribe to Dan ARG YouTube, try make you subscribe so that make you fully hear all the things where they happen for Nigeria. Make I leave you now with this video, make you help us share them. Thank you for watching Dan ARG YouTube.